about 9.15. I got to stop at that pilot there in Murfreesboro and top the reefer off because this is a drop. Dropped off my load at Walmart, grabbed an empty, and now I'm gonna head up back up to the pilot, get the wash out, get the trailer topped off, and uh, 
be ready for my next load. Find me a parking spot up there. I hate this intersection.
season it's ready now but I'm gonna pick it up and I'm gonna head to the house take a break there and leave out in the morning from there I came down here and I went this way but they didn't have that they didn't have it open up at Jackson Street there they had to turn around and come back but now they got it opened up
Hey everybody, I'm here at Tyson. Still waiting for my load to be done. But while I was here, I uh, wired these lights in. Now I know I mentioned in my vlog, previous vlog, these lights and these end caps light up. Top and bottom. I mean, they're not that bright, but when it gets dark outside, they'll probably light up a lot better. But I wired them all the way to my tail lights. But you can see that red and black wire right there. That's the wire to wire them in. Yeah, I'm sure I could have wired them into the wire up there, but I'd have to do a lot of digging. I didn't want to do that. And they work for the turn signals as well. So if I turn my left turn signal on, the left one would blink. And if I turn the right, the right one would blink. The other thing I did is my fan went out. <clears throat> so I had to install a new fan. So now it's working good. Yeah, that's it. Alright. I did another video here to see how much brighter they are. They're pretty, they're pretty bright. I mean, if you're a car coming up, you definitely notice them. See my Peterbilt logo on the ground? I gotta fix that. I gotta lie to that better. Pretty cool. I'm shooting this video with my iPad. My iPhone's busy right now. And the other side. Hey everybody, oh, my load's still not ready, which is fine because I'm going to bed here in a little bit and I'll leave it out in the morning. So anyway, you saw that video, I, uh, I hooked up those, that yellow wire on those, my lights on the side on my fairings. Well, they have these little red caps on the top and bottom. And they light up red, so I wired and in, wired them into my turn signal or to my tail lights back there. So they work with four ways, and then they work with the, each individual turn signal. Um, you know, just something to do. Um, then my APU overheated because my fan wasn't blowing hard enough. Because over time, those side fans they wear out. That one's been on for about a year now. So it, it was about due. But I carry a spare fan. So I'll be going to Springfield. Well, my truck will be going to the shop on May 7th to get two leaf springs, front suspension leaf springs, and all the bushings changed out. My oil pan gasket fixed, replaced. And then uh, uh, the fuel pump gaskets replaced and any other oil leak in there so I'll pick up another fan then but um, now on my previous in a previous vlog I showed you guys that I put LED, uh, blue LEDs in my antenna which uses this remote control I can turn it on and off from here and make it different patterns and, and whatnot. Well, I ordered the same remote and the LED controller. And what I'm going to do is uh, my other CB that I'm putting the RFX 75 on and everything, and that I, I did the uh, cutout 
on the uh, the case for it and all that, and I'm gonna put LED lights on it. Well, I am going to hook this LED controller. I need my glasses. Because this LED controller takes 5 to 24 volts to, to operate it. So, I'm going to have the CB guy wire this in. This side for the power source. And this side of the LEDs. So, all those LED lights that I'm going to be putting in, which are these right here, on the knobs and inside the light up that logo, are all going to be wired into this thing. And I'll be able to control it with this. I can dim it. I can change the speed. I can make it flash. Different types of patterns and everything. Pretty cool, huh? So that's that. Let's see what else. That's pretty much it. So, I'm going to end my vlog here. It's a bit short day. I mean, I dropped my load off at Walmart. I went to the pilot in Murfreesboro. I got fuel. I got the washout. They sent me my load. I came here to Tyson. Been here since about noontime. It's currently 7.40 p.m. So... I'm going to watch a movie and go to bed. So, if you like this video, hit that like button. Comment down below what you think of all the stuff that I'm doing. Uh, if you have any questions, just leave me a comment. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so. And I will see you guys tomorrow.